Greetings and salutations, I'm Kev. Welcome back to this Let's Play of Imperialism 2 as France. And we're not dead yet, but we're getting there. <laughs> uh, yeah. I think we're about to get a decent production base. Still nowhere near what the AI has, obviously, but hey. Gotta see what we can manage. We can't afford to buy anything, though I would love to. And the AIs are gonna expand like crazy. Weak army, yes, I know. Embassy with the Hurons, so the Hurons are now protected. And we found the zoo. Okay, which natives have we not found yet? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So a short one. The Inca, and I think they're over here somewhere. Yep, they're definitely over here somewhere. Uh, there's a port there, so they're inland here somewhere. Let's see if we can find them. Meager army. Stay behind them. Let's see. Over here. Hmm. We have enough horses for one more night. We need an army, sadly. If we're gonna survive. Just don't know how to heck how I think we're gonna do this. Cause we just we don't have the resources to do much of anything, to be honest. That's just how it goes. How much would it take us to build another night? It would be other than the labor force itself. And then the night, that's two bronze per. We need two more horses. Hmm. Okay, let's cut the sails. And let's try to bid on horses. Could even actually, we could offer a wool. I'm willing to offer wool on the market. I want to see if anyone buys it. We have such a large stockpile and we need the money. And we didn't sell it. Well, that was a given. Uh, you're willing to offer us horses. Everybody's willing to offer... Five units! Five! From Spain. Oh, sweet mother. Okay, there's not gonna be any shortage of horses anywhere. Uh, buy one, and one from you, and no more. Oh, <laughs> 21 gold left. Consulate with the Arqua. Yeah, okay. Keep exploring, they're in here somewhere. You finished that, excellent. Uh, yeah, we're gonna try to capture this and then build a road from that area. But that's not the priority one for you. You're going to be over here. I, we are transporting one more grain than... Uh, meat, right? Yes, we are. So we have enough grain to actually expand. We're going to do that then. Uh, so what you need to improve... Uh, oh dear me. They are over here. Need the timber, need the horses, get the horses. You guys don't have to stay there, but do, the, do so anyway. And we finished exploring all the coastlines. So let's see, are there any provinces that we can see that look incredibly tasty? And that aren't defended by trade pacts? There's two sugar in this one. And Jacksonville is right nearby. I don't think anyone's protecting these guys yet. Tempting. Uh, 
Let's see. Uh, let's verify which of them are protected. And by protected, I mean they have embassies. So the Huron, you can pretty much forget. Not going to be able to get into them at all. The Pueblo, same thing. And the Araqua. But not the Zoo, not the Maya, not the Aztec, not the Cherokee, or the Kawiwatsulutlitl. Those things. Those critters. <laughs> so this province is open for grabs. Potentially. The Cherokee, do you have anything that looks incredibly tasty? Not your capital, certainly. There is some spices down there. Um, right, this is the Pueblo. Never mind. That's not gonna be an area we can enter. Uh, you are, of course, there unblocking our path. The Nochtitlan starts with spices. Might be something up there. Uh, this is mostly just wastes. The Sioux capital is rather nice. And the Araqua are untouchable. Uh, we need a navy nearby to actually spy on how strong their fleets are, or their forces are. Go up here for a second. Yeah, we'd be able to invade Peabody. That shouldn't be a problem. The question is, can we invade Jacksonville? So I want to, I want to have a look first. We can't afford to invade anyway. I mean, that costs money and we do not have money now. At all. Uh, yeah, we're gonna keep producing like this. Can't afford to actually buy anything. Might as well try to sell some of our stockpile there. Heck, we can even try to sell some tin. Very much doubt there's going to be any anyone interested in these resources, but hey. Uh, attacking them is probably the best idea we... Uh, uh, best bet. Get more sugar. Can't afford to buy things, but it's nice to check availability of things. No, nope, nobody wants that either. You're expanding into the Aztecs. Low cargo space. You don't say. I, we don't have anything. I know. Uh, keep exploring. They have to be around here somewhere. Okay, you're going to try to connect up here your priority number one now. Okay, how strong... Uh, how, st uh, how strong to defend this Jacksonville? Jacksonville is actually some place we could potentially attack. Okay, let's consider this. What do I need to actually attack? A lot of things. <laughs> Next turn we need to support the Builder. Yeah, let's go with this for now. Still want to see if we can try to sell some of these raw materials. It would have been ideal. Because that's an easy source of money compared to refined goods. No sales. Portugal is also sell selling tin. Nobody's selling copper. I'm selling wool, but nobody wants to buy. Nobody we care about, at least. Okay, we've done everything there. Okay, let's find the capital. It should be right there. 
and start exploring this area. If we plan to attack there, we need to be ready to actually invade. Meanwhile, we need to expand the food supply so that we can have the larger army. Stay put, cannot afford to attack yet. Still this makeup. No, 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 I can train more people. We are transporting enough grain for one more person. Not meat, but we're gonna get there. It's gonna take a while to get that road across the mountain. Now we need two fabric and four bronze for the knights. So, like so. And we can train two knights next turn. Can't afford anything. And there are the Incas. That, that's the final one. Now we found all the in, now we found all the natives. Now it's just a matter of exploring everything. We're just gonna attack people all of these so that no need to scout too much there. Um Yeah, we're gonna need money next. We're gonna need money. Uh, right, we have an extra labor force, that's fine. They're gonna be trained into knights right away. Because that's the biggest bang for our buck we can currently have. Not the greatest, but uh, for now that's what we're gonna have to go with, I think. To strengthen ourselves. The AIs have not allied each other yet. But that's coming. Are any of them trailing behind? <laughs> no. Not on that rating, at least. Let's see at the actual statistics. Overall ranking, yeah, we're far behind. Sweden is running away like crazy. Uh, diplomatic strength, that's, we're definitely going to be far behind there. Military strength, it, it doesn't look like we're too far behind, some of them. Merchant Marine. This surprises me. But I'm not dead lost there. I assume it's because they're still exploring with a lot of their ships. Export, yeah, we don't have much of that. Industry. Right now we're actually ahead of England, wow. England has overseas profits. Far behind on tech. Yeah, I don't know. If I'm going to attack, I'm gonna need money. I don't think we'll be able to sell resources at all. But hey, that's... It's going to take a few more turns before we're ready to do anything, and you're attacking the Cherokee. With two Lancers. And you kill them outright. Okay, new regiment recruited. So we're going to have a slightly more powerful army. And that's good. It's going to de deter aggressors for <laughs> a brief period of time. Um... Still need to connect this. That's an extra grain. Uh, yeah, we need to expand the workforce and army, so that's fine. No orders you, for you this turn, no orders for... Actually... Where did the bugger all was that night? Four knights and one of those. Are they going to be enough to take the capital? The tiger? I don't know. But we're going to find out. If we're going to be able to do that, we need, to need uh, 500 gold to attack. Just a test. <sighs> we would get that, actually, if we sold the cloth. So let's try that. Uh, 
And if we're gonna fix that province afterward, we're gonna need resources. Yeah, we're short on meat. It's gonna be fine once the road completes across the mountain. Fair good, so now we're slightly stronger, and we're actually stronger than England and Portugal, I think. Please tell me that's the case. Not quite. Not on military strength, but I think this is just land, I think. <sighs> anyway, we're gonna need to move our troops there, we're hopefully gonna, hopefully gonna make enough money, we might just be able to take the capital, and if we can do that... We can hopefully hook up resources here and even connect the silver, which would be fantastic. Oh, you're attacking. My goodness, you're attacking everywhere now all of a sudden, Spain. Sold to fabric. Keep exploring this area. We could attack. Probably I'm gonna do so. Just need to think about that for a second. Let's see, enough resources for a road next turn, and enough for a builder action, and we're build, saving up resources for a... Uh, for a fort. Uh, I don't know, we're gonna keep bidding, but I don't think we're actually gonna get anything there. Okay, we need to take chances, so I'm gonna save, and go with this, and see. Here's the thing, this time it doesn't matter if they retreat, they have nowhere to retreat to, that's the last province. And it's a capital province, so we're gonna get a lot of money out of it. Treasury is currently 61, let's have a look at how, what that ends up being, uh, actually 325 because we sold one fabric. The numbers haven't changed. There's no benefit for me in um, retreating this time, so we're just going to advance. The sad thing is that by doing this, that's true, that, that, damn it, I should have thought about that, now he's going to get first strike. That's a problem. But this is just a test. I want to see if it's possible. And I'm gonna cheat. I said it, I said it before, I'm gonna cheat. And this is especially true now. On this one. I just might have to retry this to be sh make sure I actually win. It's gonna get ugly. I don't know if we can succeed, but I'm gonna try. There are two things that can't happen. We cannot afford to lose a single unit, except maybe the Peasant Levy. Okay, the Peasant Levy is now in retreat. Should be. And he died. Uh, of course he did. Okay, you're still fighting. Knock you out. You're knocked out, good. Um, you can knock you out. Good, we did. You can't move. Damn it, okay. Make sure this guy can't do anything. If the peasant levy died, it's really annoying, but it's the weakest military unit we have. So we can replace it now with something more substantial. So, it's not a complete disaster. Damn it, still, still some fight left in you, huh? There we go. No more fight in you. Go here and attack this guy. And you can't move, just hit this guy then. So we're gonna win. I think, I hope. Can't afford to lose one of the knights, though. I 
think that just gives the archer. And as far as I know, they can't retreat to another kind of a, another Indian Empire. So since they don't have any more provinces, this is going to be the end of them. Still, going to give us experience and some satisfaction. Destroying them. For our dear peasant levy. How dare you kill our peasant levy. Those were our peasants done it. Okay, there we go. So we took the capital. And as you can see on our cash flow, it went way up. So we made about 1900 gold, I think, in taking the capital. Very good indeed. I got another tech. Fantastic. Okay. Life is looking up somewhat. I did see that Spanish ship out there. I'm not sure what he's up to, but no good seems like a proper option. Uh, I think, yeah, they're gonna connect that road. I We don't have access to the horses. You're gonna go, not yet anyway, but you're definitely gonna improve the silver. I'm gonna get the other guy over here to build a fort and then a road up to the silver. The knights will just have to wait there. Heal up. We can now transport fish, timber, sugar. Great. Definitely gonna transport the food. And the timber. Um, do we want to transport the sugar yet? I'll hold off on that for a second. Again, the knights are the best bank for our buck thing. So I need... Let's see, I need three cloth. One for the knight itself and one for the worker to replace him. I need two bronze. We already have that, but we're also going to need the bronze for the fort. We're going to need the two horses. Okay, we're going to do this. We're not going to sell that. We're going to stop selling all our resources. We are going to try to bid on horses. Buy two units of horses. And replace that guy with a knight. I think that's going to be the bet. best bet. Okay, so nobody's gone for sugar refining or timber gathering yet. Cossacks, not gonna happen. Diplomacy leads to fun things, I think. Same with spices gathering. But I do believe land enclosure is where we're gonna go. Not quite ready to make... Uh, make investments in tech. But we don't have an actual stable income yet. But we're getting there. Yeah, another night is what we're gonna go for, I think. Not gonna buy anything. Right, we did want horses. Two units of horses. Buy the one from Scotland. Need one more horse. Get you, sir. Get your butt over to the new world. We're gonna need a fort here. How are you doing? You are starting to heal up. Good. I mean, our ship's still down there. I'm <laughs> trying to make a landfall. Um, yeah, we need one more unit of bronze. This is true. We need more timber. We need one more cloth. Train that dude now. Then, if we can buy another unit of horse, we should be good enough to. We should be good to get that horse, uh, that knight recruit next turn. Yes. Words. Words and things. Right, let's see. No, one timber. 
You offer us a horse? There you go, one horse from Spain. No more on that. Damn it! Of course Spain is beginning to expand down in the quacky little area. Ah. Grumble. Curse you, Spain. I'm trying to, like, make a foothold here and now you're invading and ruining everything. Ah. Okay, that's... Okay, we're gonna have to change our plans a bit then. You're gonna build a fort. And I don't dare wait anymore. And you can't do anything, so no orders for you. Knights, uh, the weakest two knights are gonna go and attack. I'm gonna try to save us money. I don't think there's more than... units. I don't think we need more than that. To take the province. And then I think we wanna push for the capital. Uh, they... yeah, the annoying part is that Spain walled us off from the rest of the country. Huh. Which is a pity. But it is what it is. I guess we're gonna have to go with Diplomacy 1. We'd like to take sugar refining, but I think sugar refining with only one backer. Well, that's not too much, actually. But we need both this tech and the next level. Let's hold off for a second. And get the uh, diplomacy one. Okay. Fair good. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're gonna need a lot of resources to build up our country. Resources we don't have. But we're gonna try. We are gonna try. Oh. For now, though, it's time for a break. But I do think we wanna land in the south there and try to get a second native capital. As we learned in our Portugal game, we can't conquer all the natives, because if we do that, it's going to be impossible to sell resources. <laughs> so we need to make diplomatic ties with one of them, or try to at least. But it ain't going to be these guys. And it ain't going to be this time either. It's time for a break, and we'll see how this invasion of ours goes. Thank you for watching. <laughs>